Hey there guys, welcome back to the third capstone update. Uh, this is going to be in regards to the uh, traps I set up. Um, so I made a little room here uh, with several traps. I set them up with some custom animations and also have them dealing damage to me on collision uh, for most of them. Um, keep an eye on the player health over here so you can see kind of um, how much damage each thing does. Uh, so first off we have a uh, classic swinging axe here. If you get hit with that it does 10 damage or so. Um, so you don't want to get hit by that, pretty simple. Walking over here, you have a uh, flame trap, so you'll trigger it a little bit ahead of time. If you stand within it, it'll start dealing damage. If you're kind of outside of it, it won't. Uh, and it'll stop playing kind of based on the trigger. Then you have uh, saw blades here. Um, so again, these are kind of similar just to swinging axe. If it touches you, I think it does about 10 damage or so. Um, they're desynced. Uh, these swinging apps are also swinging axes also desynced. I think they just got lucky. <laughs> There's a couple uh, seconds at uh, on start where it'll choose when to start. Uh, this is similar to the flame trap, but it's poison, so it does a little bit less damage than the flames, but once you leave, it uh, continues to do a little bit of damage. Um, I don't know if you can catch that over there. Then you have the electric grate. goes on and off every four seconds or so. Um, it's safe to stand on without electricity, but then when it starts, it deals 10 damage every every second. And then once it's off again, it stops. And uh, finally, we have the wall there, which just tried to get me. Um, so you can stand here, and then it'll get you for about 10. And then when you back up, it, it resets. Um, and so those are basically the traps that, we, uh, that we're that we going to use for our game. We'll set them up with room prefabs, and then have them loading in with various rooms and different layouts for the traps and stuff like that. I was also just tweaking... Previous mechanics, I don't think I'm going to show it in this video, but just the equipping, we had some bugs that we weren't expecting, but I fixed that. Um, so now every weapon, because we added some more weapons, and so now we have about 10, and they all switch just fine. Um, as well as some enemy collision and enemy damaging things. Um, so yeah, that's basically the bulk of what I worked on in this past week or so. Thanks for checking back in, guys, and I'll uh, see you for the next update.